I'm Dr. John Williams, breast surgeon with the Breast Cancer School for Patients. Our radiation oncology course covers the important topics that you will discuss with your breast cancer radiation oncologist. And once you finish taking our course and looking at our videos, you can find out more about cutting edge radiation technologies and how radiation can reduce your risk of your breast cancer coming back. If you've been diagnosed with breast cancer, there's a good chance you'll be offered breast radiation. When the time comes, you'll consult with a radiation oncologist, either after surgery or after surgery and chemotherapy are both completed. Radiation oncologists are different from breast radiologists who interpret mammograms, breast ultrasounds, and MRIs at an imaging center. Radiation oncologists are specially trained cancer doctors that use sophisticated radiation equipment to focus beams of intense radiation to kill cancer cells. You'll get better breast cancer care when your radiation oncologist works as a team with your breast surgeon. Many of the recent cutting edge treatments in breast cancer care are actually advancements in breast radiation. If you're gonna have a surgical lumpectomy to remove your breast cancer, then you'll likely need radiation to reduce the chance of cancer growing back in the surgical area. Radiation is only occasionally needed after a mastectomy, and this is called post-mastectomy radiation therapy. It's usually reserved for more advanced, larger cancers that have spread to the lymph nodes, or if the cancers recurred in the breast or skin after a prior breast cancer surgery. If you think you might need post-mastectomy radiation therapy, it's essential to see your radiation oncologist before you have mastectomy surgery, because they can better understand the size, the shape, and extent of your breast tumor before it's removed by surgery or shrunk away with chemotherapy. New cutting edge radiation therapies are designed to achieve excellent outcomes with more focused treatment, fewer side effects, and less personal distress. But even if you qualify for one of these treatments, that doesn't mean it's always the best option for your unique cancer. That's why you and your radiation oncologist must work together to decide the best treatment pathway for you. It's also important to note that most of the cutting edge options we talk about at the Breast Cancer School for Patients are only appropriate for a few select cancer patients. But it's critical for you to be aware of them. So we teach you how to make sure your radiation oncologist considers all the options by asking them some key questions like, how can I avoid radiation and its side effects? Would I benefit from a shorter course of radiation? Am I a candidate for brachytherapy or intraoperative breast radiation? Is prone breast radiation a better option for me? Or would a genomic assay help me avoid radiation? You'll want to ask your breast surgeon or medical oncologist if you should be referred to see a radiation oncologist before surgery or chemotherapy. Most patients have early stage breast cancer and don't need to see a radiation oncologist until after their surgery. But if you have inflammatory breast cancer or a large tumor, you will get better care in these situations if you visit with a radiation oncologist early in your treatment journey. The Breast Cancer School for Patients helps you speak with your radiation oncologist in a unique way. Our short video courses show you exactly what will be discussed so you can quickly become an expert in cancer treatment. I also encourage you to print our course notes and bring them with you to your appointments to make sure you're offered the best treatment choices. And when the time comes, you'll be able to make important treatment decisions confidently, armed with all the knowledge and resources available to you through the Breast Cancer School for Patients. We're here to help you get the best possible breast cancer care in your community. Register on our website to get our list of questions to prepare you for your next doctor visit.